My son Gideon just recently got his CDL and so now he's gonna take me for a ride in the boom truck. I'm a little nervous. Hi, we are Luke and Heather Bell and we have eight children and we are just the Bells 10. All right, here he comes to take me for a ride in the boom truck. <laughs> I'm a little nervous, Gideon. Why? Cause like- I took the whole class and everything. Hmm. All right, so we have to walk to the shop. Uh, I don't know if we're dressed for this, but it don't matter. It don't matter to me. Okay, so he just passed his class with flying colors. I think he got like 100%. 90 out of 90 and 60 out of 60. They said that he was top-notch driving. So uh, this is one of the things we're doing now on New Year's Eve. So we're going to go for a little trip. Like you can legally do this like dad doesn't have to be in. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Okay. You got to be slower. I don't have a lot of uh, traction on my shoes. Okay. It's kind of icy. That's a goal. You get a new egg truck this year or next year. I guess it's not next. It's not this year. There's the horses. Hi, girls. Hi, girls. Why does Daisy have a collar on? Izzy must have put that on. Okay. We got our horses and the cows. I should have probably put a coat on, but it's pretty nice outside. All right. Chickens are kind of quiet in there. They must be resting. All right, brand new boom truck. My husband's truck. How are you gonna get through here? There's not much room right here, Gideon. Cause the trailer's in the way. All right. I don't know anything about anything. No, I guess not. Definitely not about the boom truck. Da, 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 da. That's his new favorite song. The little boy sang a song and they it's just flying all over TikTok and everything. It's absolutely adorable. All right, here we go. You got it. How do you keep it up? Oh wait, it's just a little You got this. Brother. No, that's a bad one. Oh, maybe it's not. Oh. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> Woo Said he's warming it up for me. He looks good in there. There are so many buttons. Have you drove this one before? Oh, I can get in? Okay. Said I can get in. Here we go. You've already used all the buttons and stuff? Okay. driven in a big truck like this before. Here comes my chauffeur. This is pretty cool. This is a nice, uh, all right. Do you feel pretty confident driving? Extremely. Without dad and just me? How do I lower my seat? Can I lower my seat? I probably know more than dad on these. Really? Can I lower my seat too? Cause mine's up pretty high. There's a little air button on the side. Air, which side? The other side. The other side. Oh, no, that one doesn't have it. Never mind. Okay, we got air. Ready to go, Mrs. B? I'm ready. Let's go. <laughs> Who watched it like this? This is awesome. Nice. I'm in your window, I'm sure. Does this have four-wheel drive? Okay, I gotta go shut that door. Okay. Well, this is really cool. He had to go shut the garage door, but uh, I, I feel so high up. Like I'm really, really high up. This is kind of crazy. I hope he goes super slow. I'm a little nervous. Here he comes. Okay, I'm ready. 
for? So I can see my side. Oh, that's kind of cool. Okay, I'm learning. Most trucks have mirrors on the front so you can see the sides too. Oh, bad. okay. Okay, there's a mirror up there, mirror right there. Boy, if people get sick to their stomach, they're really gonna get sick to their stomach watching this one. Brendan could have gotten in the middle. Maybe he could drop me off and go get Brendan or something. We're gonna drive the other one with Brendan. Oh, the older one? Yeah. Okay. That one's an actual manual. What's this one? This one's an automatic. Oh, you mean like shifting manual? Yeah. Okay. This one's not. Oh, sorry, I'm in your way. So are you allowed to go on the main road with this? There's no restrictions? Okay. And then that's pretty much the chance that you just ride. I am, I'm just riding. Should pick up the Schlems in this. I guess you only have one seat. Turn signal? No, uh, there's an engine brake on this. Where's the button for it? Is it this? Yeah, that's it. Good. Are you excited to start using it next season? Yeah, for sure. I know you're on your side of the road. You get used to it? Trying to keep it steady so people don't get sick to their stomachs. Well, these trucks aren't really known for their steadiness. No, I know. There's the back. There oh. we go. So do you know how to run that too? What? The boom part. Oh yeah. Touching the bottom because I'm short. I'm average height, but I got short legs, I guess. So, do you enjoy this? Like, is what this is? No, nice. that's awesome. <laughs> Ooh, it is kind of bumpy. We're getting on the highway, so it'll be better. Yeah. This even got a cruise on it. What? Alright, I got it back on now. You guys shouldn't be as seasick, car sick. I can't believe we barely have any snow. It's kind of crazy. Look at that. Usually we have feet, feet and feet upon feet of snow. Our ice rink is done. The ice is gone. Is Dad gonna flood that so it, it's pretty warm though. I don't know what we're gonna do tonight. Oh, it's still a little shaky. Yeah, it'll get better once we hit this next gear. Okay. Like fifth, so. Yeah, once I hit six, yeah, there you go. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's pretty roomy in here though. No, it is, it's really nice. Got a screen, it's like a Cadillac. It's like a Cadillac, yes. Guess how much it gets per uh, mile per gallon? 10. 3.6. Three miles per gallon? Yeah. Ooh, that's not good. Nope. Good thing it's not used for leisure, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Except it's got two 75 gallon tanks, so. Oh, so you don't have to get gas as much? No. Okay. You're doing good. Is this easier to drive than the ones you drove at school? Yeah. Much easier. Were the other ones longer? Yeah. Oh. And the other ones were manuals. Were what? Manuals. Oh, okay. Manual meaning gears. Okay. I'm about to go drive that other one for fun. Yeah. Well, we got the time today. We you just going to make a circle and go home? I'll probably do the same circle. I'm going to do take you on that one. What are you going to go up the next road, up that big hill? Yeah. Okay. 
All right, now we're on our road. We did a circle. He's gonna go back and get the older truck and Brendan gets the next ride. I'll have to video you guys pulling out so they can kind of see y'all in action. Woo! Gonna have to have uh, this is gonna be a, a good road. stomach coming on this. I'm not gonna be able to video this whole road or you guys are gonna be super duper sick. I'm trying so hard to keep the camera still. It's just not working. You know my seat? Woo! Keeps me level up there. Really? Yeah, Ugh. So I have mine bounces every time. See, what? Why doesn't the passenger seats do that? I don't know why this one doesn't. Normally they do. <laughs> I'm even getting sick watching. So we're kind of slowing down, so I thought I'd at least get part of it. We got the windiest road ever that we're going down. Yeah, this truck's actually pretty small compared to the truck. Really? Well, the actual truck itself isn't, but the length is. Oh. And width. Okay. This is actually a pretty big center. T-880 Chandler. T-880. With the Cummins. If anyone out there is wondering. If anybody out there is wondering. T-880 with the Cummins. With the Cummins engine. With the Cummins engine. I think only guys are going to be able to watch this one because it's so like, Kenworth. so like jumpy. I'm trying so hard to stay still though. <laughs> I'm sorry. All right, we're back on our road. There's our neighbors. Not super cool. Oh, there's our horses. There's our horses. <laughs> and our cows. It's nice to see horses again. Very nice. Got our dish going on back there. There's the old pump truck. Yeah, I was up in that roof yesterday. There's the front. rental where my boys live. You did good, Gideon. I'm proud of you. This truck doesn't have the turning radius to make it here. What was that? Oh, that's mine. Ooh, watch out for that little ditch right there on your side. Yes, Mom, I can see that. Okay, well, there's my old suburban. You're gonna back in the whole way? Yeah. Oh. All right, now I'm gonna watch his backing up skills. I told him it'd be more better to watch it from the outside instead of the inside so you guys can actually see his skills. All right, he's chatting with dad. He's gonna back all the way down the driveway. He's like, Mom, it goes so fast that you won't even be able to see it. That's a nice looking truck. And it has a nice looking payment. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Oh, Dad's guiding him. Right unlike that, because they all like to figure things out on their own. Dad's got to be a park. Oh, he's going to take off all the salt off the truck before he keeps backing up. Is that where you're stopping? Is he doing that right now? Yeah, we got power the ice. I mean, the salt. Is Dad going to do it right now? She's a beast. She's beautiful. So we're getting all the salt off the truck because it's not going to be used until next season. So we don't want that salt sitting on there and rusting everything and, you know, and it's like, you know, they're a little baby now. It's like they're sweet little babies, so they want to take care of it extra good. No, it's very exciting, like super exciting that uh, my boys are wanting to invest in the company, that they, Robert's taking the class here next month. Robert's talking about getting a pump truck and actually be pumping the concrete. So no, so Gideon would do the panel truck. No, Robert would start his own business pump pumping the concrete and then we would just you know he would pay us or we'd pay him for pumping concrete and so that'd be kind of like a business for him it'd be like an extension of our business but it'd be his so I don't know I'm really excited that my my boys are really wanting to be a part of this and be a part of our masonry crew and 
you know, have a future in the company because we don't want to do this forever. We'd like our boys to take it over. We'd like them to invest in it. And, you know, and Haley with the farm. Oh, 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 sorry about that. You know, she wants to do the farm. And, and maybe if her and David get together, they'll buy the farm for us from us. And that will be their thing, you know. So that's why we do all these businesses is we do it because we're investing in our children. We, we want our children to take this over. We want to help them get on their feet. And Haley does a really great job. A lot of people say, oh, her house, she didn't pay for anything. And she did. And she works a lot at the farm. She's running all over the UP. I know I'm shaking a little bit. She runs all over the place to pay for her house. She's doing great. You know, all my kids are wanting to invest in their future. And, and you know what? It's because of this guy right here. Their hardworking dad that has really invested and really worked hard to give them a platform, you know, like a foundation to start on. And I'm just, I'm so proud of my kids. I'm so proud of my husband and I'm probably gonna start crying. Good thing the camera's not on me, but I am very proud of them. They work really hard. Our kids work really hard. I just, I don't know, I love my family so much. My husband's done a great job. You know, he's on his knees every single night praying for his family. He's up every morning reading his Bible, praying for us again. He just really is a wonderful role model to my boys, a godly testimony to my boys. He's just so hard worker. And even though he deals with things like, you know, having to have back surgery and his legs not working right and having pain, he gets up every single day, takes care of our family. Oh, I don't know why I always cry. And he doesn't complain. He never complains. He just works and takes care of us. And <laughs> My husband says to come over here, but I don't want to get wet. I'm freezing. What does he want me to do? Do not spray me. Do not spray me. Oh, my shoe just came off. Ah! My feet are sticky and the water's wetting the, it's wetting the snow. And now I'm sticking to it. What? Don't spray it on me! Oh! Did you put that there on purpose? Yeah, you did. Yeah, I did. Yeah, it was from yesterday. I walked around this thing multiple times. That's fine. All right, it looks beautiful. You gonna start backing it up or what? Yeah. I'm so cold. Don't want to step on the horse poop. Grossy, rosy. Wish I snowmobile. Can't even get it out because there's no snow on the ground. Look at this. I don't think salt got all the way up on top. We only went. Well, I want to see him back it up. How long is this going to take? I'm freezing. Okay, good. We're going to start parking it. Let me get out of the way. They need to do that to my Suburban. My Suburban's a mess. All right, had to get the water bottle out of the way. Fun times at the Bell House. Always something going on at our house. I don't know, I don't think I could do this. I just can't believe how my kids are all growing up. I mean, my 18 year old son is in a huge truck, took his CDL and now he's gonna get his lift? No, something lift. Uh, I don't. What's that other license? Do you want him to get a lift license or a a crane license? A crane license. Oh. It looks a little high to go in there.
They all want to drive it. My husband says, do you want me to back it in? <laughs> Gideon, do you want me to back it in? He's like, no, I'll back it in. Are you sure I can back it in? He's like, no, I'll back it in. He's like, okay, you back it in. You sure you don't want me to back it in? Gideon's like, no, I'll back it in. <laughs> <laughs> he's very proud I've never seen my kid smile so much he just he hated school once he got out of school he flourished there's my husband helping out he absolutely flourished working hard in our job just working hard getting his CDL gonna get his crane license wow nice work Good job. Good job, son. Good job. That's all she wrote. And that's a wrap. Okay, he did a really good job taking mom on a trip. Looks like he's gonna go to the next one, but thank you so much for joining us with my son taking me on a ride in the boom truck. He did a great job. If you haven't subscribed and like our page, please do it. Thank you for your support and all your kind words. I'm trying not to fall on the slippery ice and snow. Happy New Year. Thank you for everything. Look out for the next video. I know, I called him. We're granting a ping pong table to have ping pong matches tonight. I do love to sing. I hope I'm singing okay. All right, well, thank you so much for joining us and have a wonderful 2023. I can't believe it's 2023. Oh, crazy. I just rhymed. I'm a poet and I don't even know it. Actually, I'm a poet and now I know it, right? Yeah.